Hi guys, this is Denise and welcome to my channel. This is my first makeup tutorial and I'm going to show you how I create this makeup look. I'm going to start with this primer from YSL and spread this evenly across my face. With this primer, I won't have to deal with flaky foundation. Moving on to my foundation, I'm using this one here from Chanel's Vital Lumiere in shade 30. I buff it in with my stippling brush to make it all smooth and even. I'm going to set my foundation with my hourglass ambient lighting powder for that warm glow. For the brows, I'm using this grey one here from M Pro, and I'm just going to fill up the sparse areas and set it with this YSL brow mascara. And what I like to do is I'll comb it upward to make it look fuller and intensified. I sweep this taupe color from the YSL Tuxedo palette and apply this along the crease to add a subtle definition with my blending brush in the Wayne Goss number 19. And once I'm done with that, I use the shade number 2 and blend it close to the crease for that gradient effect. as I go along the way. Next, I'm going to use the shade number 3 which has this dark grey shimmer and I like this better because um, I find it less intense and softer as compared to your ordinary black shade. And I place this color on the outer corner and the lower lid and I use the same blending brush to blend it out. Now I'm using this eyeliner pencil from Charlotte Tilbury in Barbarella Brown and I'll just line my eyes and give myself a slight cat eye. And on my lashes, I'll curl them and apply loads of mascaras to make them look long and luscious. And on my cheeks, I'm using this one here from Benefit Rocketeur. And I'll just apply this on the apples of my cheeks. Okay, we're almost there. So for the bronzer, I'll brush it upward and, and I'll brush it towards the same direction repeatedly until I'm satisfied with the depth. And I put some of that on the side of my forehead and on my lower jawline. And from my Stella palette, I use this gold shimmery color as a highlighter and put this along my nose bridge. And with that same bronze shade, I apply this on the side of my nose to make it look more defined.
and with that same highlighter shade I apply this on the highest point of my cheekbones and towards the brow like a U shape I line my lips with the NARS lip liner in Patton Beach. I really like this warm rosy shade because it complements almost everyone and you can almost wear it all year round. And if you want to opt for a nude alternative, my favorite nude lipstick is from Charlotte Tilbury's in Penelope Pink. It has a light hint of pink and it has a smooth and velvety texture. Alright, there you have it. That's my take on a natural smoky look. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and please give me a thumbs up if you like more videos and I'll see you on my next one. Bye!